side up, 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 I'm the side that gets blue. Life's too short to worry more. Wear a smile and trouble will go. Keep your funny side up, up, let your laughter come true. Do stand up on your legs, be like two. He's a funny bloke, Clarence. A removals man. Not at all suited to his job. For a start, he's as blind as a bat. Can't see beyond his own pebble glasses. Won't admit it, mind you. Very proud of his skill and his strength. And at the same time, the clumsiest man I ever met. <laughs> he's ever so nice, though. I only met him last week, but I do like him. On coronation day it was, he came to move Madam out. And we got on ever so well. He proposed before the day was out. Not to me, but he thought he was proposing to me. <laughs> so anyway, I ran after him and told him I'd think it over. Then he suggested we go up to see the coronation bonfires. The bonfires. Of course, I'd love to. Oh, good, then we'll go down the pub, collect a van, kick me mate out, and we'll go back to my place for fish and chips. Oh, where do you live? Peckham. Peckham? They'll be cold by the time we get them home. No, they won't. I've solved that years ago. How? I live over the chip shop. <laughs> <laughs> Does a nice bit of fish downstairs, doesn't he? Mmm, lovely. Yeah. Good fat chips and all. Mm. I like eating them best out of the paper, really. Here, do you know the biggest selling newspaper in the Welsh mining villages? The Times. Do you know why? Because it's thicker, makes better tablecloths. Oh, no, that's true. That's a gospel truth, that is. They can't afford tablecloths, you see. So they buy the Times. Do you want some salt? No, 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 no thanks. <laughs> I like a bit of salt. Well, it must be damp. Here, try this one. Oh, ta. What's the other one? Pepper, is it? A torch battery. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. That's good, isn't it? It's not a salt and pepper, it's a salt and battery. <laughs> <laughs> That's not bad for this time of night, is it, eh? <laughs> salt and battery, yeah. Uh. Well, what do you think of the old place, eh? It's not much, but it's home. Did you, uh... Did you decorate it yourself? Yeah, oh yeah. Did all the decorating, yeah. I like decorating, yeah. Yeah, I did the bedroom at the same time. What colour is the bedroom? Blue and white? How the devil did you know that? <laughs> oh, I just guessed. I like blue and white for a bedroom. Lots of people have blue and white bedrooms. How oh, do they? Been in a lot of bedrooms, have you, yeah, naughty girl? You told me you was a good girl. <laughs> in my job, silly. Oh, I yeah. see a lot in my job. Oh, yeah, right, yeah, yeah. Now, it is blue with a, a white stripe, see? Yeah. I do that always white with a blue stripe. Difficult to tell, in it, with stripes. You don't know which is the stripe and which is the other bit, do you? <laughs> like a cup of tea, would you? No, 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 no. I'll do that. Hey? You just sit down and put your feet up. All right, I'll get the cup, shall I? No, 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 you sit down, I'll do all that. All right, oh. <laughs> <sighs> nice to be waited on. <laughs> Where are the cups? Uh, oh, use them over there, next to the picture of my dad there. This one? Is this the one you mean? Yeah, that's him, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah there he is, look. <laughs> Funny looking bloke, wasn't he? People say I look like him, but I can't see it myself. <laughs> Thought you were going to sit down and let me do this. Oh, yeah, right, yeah. Yeah, that's right, yeah. Take the weight off. <coughs> I'm a bit excited, you see, that's the trouble. I don't usually get people coming. Oh, yeah, yeah. right, oh, yeah, yeah right. <laughs> Do you like living on your own? Well, I'm used to it. What about you? I hate it. That's why I went into service. It's so lonely. Do you know, I've only got one real friend in the world, my guinea pig. Well, isn't that enough, then? No. Well, why don't you get another guinea pig? Now, listen, Clarence, whatever your name is. You made a proposal of marriage to me earlier on. Well, 
In a manner of speaking, anyway. No, no it wasn't you, was it? It was that other oity toy bit of grumpy, wasn't it? Oh, yes, but you thought it was me. And I am considering your offer. Just a minute. You slapped my face, didn't you? No, that was her. Oh, was it? Oh. Confusing, isn't it? Never mind. What are you trying to say, then? You're trying to say you want to back out now, now you see the way I live? No, no, no. I've got nothing to back out of. I'm still considering. Oh. And I think... Well, I think we ought to have a trial period. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, certainly, yeah. You can stay tonight if you like. <laughs> I'll show you the blue stripes in my bedroom. No, 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 that's not what I mean. I oh. mean separately. I mean live together but sleep separately. What, you mean take turns, you mean? Like the Navy, one arm, one off, you mean? <laughs> Look, just listen, will you? Just sit down, finish your meal and listen. Very good, madam. Your word is my command. Oh, <laughs> oh my God! Are you all right? Did you, did you move that chair, did you? Yeah, I must have done. I'm sorry. Yeah. Are you all right, really? Yes, yes, I'm as right as ninepence. Oh! Well, eightpence, anyhow. <laughs> <clears throat> you were saying? Well, what I'm trying to say is... I'm not going to straight away start living with you, like, in sin. You know, like a tuppenny me tart. I'm not going to live with you like that. A lot of women have done that and then regretted it. What are you talking about a lot of women have done that? There's only been two women in my life and neither of them have been tuppenny me tarts. Well, one of them was, but that didn't last long. <laughs> Why not? She put the price up to threepence. <laughs> no, no, that's not what I mean. I mean, I've met women who've been talked into this sort of arrangement and they've finished up on the scrap heap. I mean, nobody wants someone else's leftovers. What are you talking about, leftovers, scrap heap? I'm a removals man, not of a rag and bone man. <laughs> Anyhow, I'm not like that. If I get used to things, I, I like to not part with them. I like to, I like to stick to them. Like these socks, for instance. <laughs> and this old watch, you see this old watch here? That is my granddad's old watch, that. He gave me that in his will. He left it? Well, of course he did. You have to, don't you? <laughs> and, you know, ever since the day he died, I've wound that watch and I have looked after it and it's never stopped ticking from that day to this. Does it keep good time? Probably. <laughs> what time is it now? I don't know. The hands are falling off. <laughs> well, it's no good then, is it? Yes, it is to me, yes. I love that old watch. It doesn't go. Yes, it does. It goes everywhere I go. <laughs> it's an old friend. It doesn't do to abandon an old friend. How about new friends? Them neither. I hope you mean it. I do, I do. Well, I'm going to tell you something now. I had a stroke of luck recently. My auntie died of a heart attack. Oh. <laughs> More a stroke of luck for her then, was it? <laughs> it was just a stroke. Oh, well, now, really, that's not very nice. No, sorry, no. I spoke without thinking. Sorry. <laughs> Look, are you listening to me? Yeah. Because what I'm trying to tell you is this. She left this old cottage in the country to me. And 200 pounds. Ooh, good for auntie. <laughs> Still, what has that got to do with you and me sleeping together? I mean, I don't mind hobnobbing with a landed gentry. No, well, what I was trying to suggest is, why can't we go there for our trial period? It's got two bedrooms. Well, live there, you mean? Mm -hmm. well, what about my job? Well, you're your own master. It's your own van. You can do removals and odd jobs in the country just the same as up here. But what about my contacts? Have you got any contacts? No. <laughs> oh, it would be nice in the country. Oh, I don't know about that. I mean, I haven't even seen the place, have I? I'd have to have a good look at the place close to. Well, you could take me down there. Yeah, you could take me down there in the van. What would we live on, though? The £200, until you got some work. Well, I'd have to sell up here, wouldn't I? Well, we'd have that money as well. <sighs> Look, just give me a little time to think about it, would you? Oh, yeah, yes, all right. Yeah, I must be going soon. <laughs> Paddy will wonder where I am. Paddy? My guinea pig. Oh, I see. <laughs> cool. I had visions of some big airy Irish when I was going to have to fight to get you. No. No one to fight. I think you're ever so nice. Huh. 
Right, well, I'm going now. All right, then. Give us a nice kiss to be going on with, then. Oh, no, 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 I mustn't. I've got scruples. Oh, that's all right. I had them when I was a kid. <laughs> Tastes nice and all. <laughs> How about going to pictures tomorrow night, eh? Yeah, all right. Huh. Which one? Oh, let's go to the electric Wallam Green. The bloke says a great juicy picture on there. Lovely it is. It's about a man who kills everyone in sight, including his mother, and he drives his best girl mad. Oh, yes, I know the one you mean. Oh, do you? What's it called? Well, last time I saw it, it was called Hamlet. <laughs> <laughs> It's good, wasn't it? Yeah. I still think you'd see better from the front row. That was the front row. Oh. <laughs> well, so, the decision is yes, then? Yeah, yeah. We'll give it a go. Well, we'll go and have a look, anyhow. Right. I'll pick you up in a van Monday, all right? Yeah. All right, then. Oh, come on, come on. Oh, well. Oi! Come to that at home, not outside my cinema. <laughs> hey, a couple like you ought to be over all that sort of thing by now. Who are you calling, old mate? You better watch what you're talking about. <laughs> you know spring chicken yourself, are you? <laughs> Ugly old devil. <laughs> Rubbing out the clouds of grey, they must have known just how I like it. Everything's coming my way. Hey, this fog had to come down, didn't it? <laughs> yes, you better go careful. I always go careful. How do you think you're doing the land we're living? Yes, that's a question that had crossed my mind. Oh, if we turn left here. That's right, I I know you did. I just thought it'd be a nice place to stop to have our sandwiches. <laughs> oh, dear. What's that funny smell? That's the countryside. Oh, we're strong, isn't it? Well, that's lovely. That's the earth. And the hay. And the cows and that. <laughs> cows, is it? That's a cow, isn't it? Mm. Of course it is. Don't tell me you've never seen a cow before. Well, only on the pictures. They don't bite, do they? No, they just chew the cud. Oh, thanks for the warning. I'm <laughs> sure keep mine well out of the way. <laughs> what a dog. Yeah. Pleasant, though, ain't I? Eh? Well, you'll do till my belted earl comes along. If he does come along, I'll belt him. <laughs> Listen. You must teach me to drive the van. Yeah, sure. Easy. I can learn you in half an hour. Good. Well, we allowed half an hour to eat our sandwiches, and it's not going to take us that long. You can teach me now. Here, get these down your neck, quick. Ah, 
that's nice, isn't it? That's the shed. I mean, it's nice for a shed. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. There's tin. A corrugated iron. Lots of little places used to be built like it. Ah. Be all right if you forget your key, won't you? All you need is a tin opener. Kept it nice, anyhow. <laughs> Needs a fair bit of work to do on it, though. Eh? A lot of decorating, wallpapering. Oh, that's all right. I'm good at wallpaper, and I'll do that. Yeah, mind you, I've never put wallpaper out on corrugated iron before. <laughs> You're right in the bathroom, wasn't it? I put my blue stripe up. Looked like the tide coming in, wasn't it? <laughs> the walls aren't wavy inside. They've been plastered. Oh, have they? Oh, yeah, so they have now. I'll take a closer look, yeah. Yeah, cool, they made a good job of that and all, look at that. <laughs> Smooth as a baby's bottom lip, that is, look at that. That'll be no trouble. God, look at the dust. Well, what's a bit of dust matter, eh? You women are all the same. When it comes to a bit of dust, you go dotty, don't you? I don't notice it myself. <laughs> <laughs> what happened, you lit the fire? Every room's the same. What a state. Still, nothing that a bit of elbow grease can't cure. Um, this is going to be my bedroom. Oh, is it? All right. Please enjoy it for you. I don't mind where I dust down myself. Oh, it's a nice view from here, isn't it? Is that the sea? <laughs> what? I say you can see the sea from here. What? In Oxfordshire? <laughs> oh, is that where we are? Oh. I never was any good at sense of direction, you know. I once uh, went to night school to learn how to map read, but I could never find my way home again. <laughs> well, what do you think? What? This place. Shall we move in? I mean, do you reckon we can make it habitable? Yeah, it's not bad, what I've seen of it. You game? Well, I am if you are. Well, I am if you are. Right then. Right in. Saturday. Let's make it Sunday. No traffic on the road. We'll pack your furniture into the van and just come here. Yeah. Pack up all our cares and woe, well, here we go, singing low. Bye, bye, Peckham. <laughs> cool. <laughs> that one ain't fixing for a start. Anyhow, the eyes of the church ain't going to be looking through the keyhole all the time, are they? They're very nosy in these little villages. They frown on people cohabiting. We're not going to be cohabiting. Just living together. <laughs> I can't see the difference. Oh, yeah? Climb it. You're just the girl I've been looking for. <laughs> Whoa, stop that! <laughs> Don't you dare when I'm driving. You know I can't drive without both hands on the wheel. I know. That's why I did it. <laughs> Clarence, would you mind putting my dress back down over my knees, please? <laughs> of course. Nothing will give me greater disappointment. <laughs> there you are. Thank you. Nice dress, that. Lovely colour. I had this for my 40th birthday. I mean, that's warm well. Oh! Hey! You took your hand off the wheel to do that, didn't you? Yeah. Well, here we are. 
Yep. You open the back of the van and we can start unloading. Well, hello, Sergeant. I'll unlock the door. I found the key. Windy, isn't it? <laughs> Oi, round this way. Hey? Oh, yeah, I was, uh, I was just having a look around the garden. <laughs> nice lot of dahlias coming up. <laughs> <sighs> Terrible smell of fish and chips on these cushions. Better leave them outside to air. Cool, dear, that old sofa needs restuffing. <laughs> Keep your hands to yourself. We're not married yet, you know. I'm oh, sorry I didn't notice you. <laughs> Do now, though. <laughs> That's enough. Yeah, plenty. <laughs> now, listen. All right, all right, all right. I know. I'll behave myself. Work to be done, all right. Come on, give us a hand with this one first. Look. Let's get this chair up. Down one. Down one. Down one there. Won't work going up when I come down one, will it? <laughs> there we are. <sighs> what is it? It's a cupboard. <laughs> yeah. Solid oak, that is. I made it out of my own head. Did you? <laughs> it's unusual for a cupboard. Uh, you're wondering why there's no back on it, ain't you? Well, it's supposed to go against the wall, you see. I realise you don't need a back when you've got doors. Well, he hasn't got no doors. No, I had to take the doors off to, to uh, put on my wardrobe, see. Oh, what happened to your wardrobe doors? Well, I had to cut them up to make the sides of this. <laughs> <laughs> and a uh, shelf, of course, you see, the shelf. Oh, I see. Now yeah. it's becoming clear. Yeah. What shelf? Uh, yeah, well, I had to use the shelf to make the bottom and the bottom fell off, see. <laughs> it's a pity that, because I used to use that shelf to keep my book on. What book? What a book I have for reading, like. Oh? What sort of book was it? The big green one. Did it have a title? Yeah, it was called The Wide Wild World, Volume 2. Ever read it? No, I can't say I have. No. Not Volume 2. It's a lovely book, that. Taught me a lot, that book. I learnt a lot from that, yeah. You could ask me anything about the world at all, and I could tell you, providing it began with C or D. <laughs> Where's the kettle? Oh, kettle begins with a K, not a C. That's not fair now, is it? It's cheating now. Oh, I wanted to make some tea, stupid. Oh, well, it'd be one on the gas, wouldn't I? Ah, oh, there ain't no gas. No gas? No, not in the country. There never is. They can't lay gas pipes right out here. Well, how do we go on, then? Everything has to be heated on the fire. The range. Well, it's no electric, either. No. Well, what do we do when it gets all dark, then? I hope. <laughs> We light the oil lamps oh, yeah. and candles at bedtime. Oh, I usually have cocoa. <laughs> well, I might be able to manage some of that. Oh, good. Might it be something else you could manage some of? Now, listen, my lad, it's still broad daylight and we've still got half a van load to shift. Come on. All right, and just let me put this in the corner. Come on, give us a lift with this. <coughs> That's it. That's better. Have we got any candles? Dozens. Ah, oh, pity. I <laughs> <laughs> oh, got the wireless going now, see. <laughs> to think how often this tune must have been played on this old pianola over the years. Yeah. She used to sing it to us when we was little. Yeah. Her favourite, was it? Yeah. Beautiful, isn't it? Lovely, isn't it? Yeah. Any old iron, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> no, any old iron. Love's old sweet song. Oh, yeah. I always mix them two up, yeah. <laughs> Do you know, I know every note of it. Do you? Some 
Mama makes Auntie seem so close, just like when we was kids. You somehow feel she might be here with us in this very room. Yeah. There she is, look! Where, where? Where? Hello, <laughs> Tony, that's her. Oh, God, you didn't half give me a turn then. <laughs> I thought you meant really. I hate ghosts, especially dead ones. <laughs> oh, that's her, is it? Was it, I mean? <laughs> she looks a cheery old soul anyway, doesn't she? Well, come on, look, this one do. We've got to get on. What we got to do next? Come on. Well, I suppose we ought to get the bedrooms in some sort of order. Yeah. Hey, good fun, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, I'm enjoying myself, yeah. I mean, it makes a change, doesn't it, me shifting furniture and you tidying the place up? <laughs> oh, well, it's different when it's your own place. Yeah. Well, come on. Will you get my bed up for me if I sort out the kitchen things? Yeah, certainly. I've got to get you to bed somehow tonight, haven't I? <laughs> Room cupboard is, do you? Oh, you got it put together then? Yeah, solid as a rock, this bed, yeah. Yeah. It's deceiving though, isn't it? You know, this is quite heavy, this bed is. Not to me, but a normal man, like... Oh, well, I'm glad you're feeling strong. Oh, yeah. Because there's a box up. Oh, God, a mouse! A what? Oh, God, oh, I hate I, them! I, I, get it! Get how, it! How can I get it? Were you on top of me? Oh, is it gone? Oh, God, we've got to get something for them. Listen, if you're going to go on like this, I'll get some more in. <laughs> hey, what? What are you doing with my knickers? I never touched you. <laughs> oh, please. Thank you very much. They're my unmentionables. Oh, don't mention it. <laughs> what are you doing with them? Oh, just mopping my brow, that's all. I thought it was a bit smooth for a duster. Now don't get personal again. I wonder where that mouse went. Listen, I've got some mouse traps in my crate out there. You got any cheese on them? Oh, yes, a bit. I'll set some up. Yeah, right up. Oh, dear. Did you hear that? These boards are a bit squeaky. There might be a bit of dry rot in there. Oh, Lord. That's bad, isn't it? Well, it depends how rotten it is and how dry it is. I'll get my claw hammer out and investigate. It's getting a bit parky in here, isn't it? Yeah, no. I'm going to clear the grate out in the other room and light a fire. Yeah. Look, see if we can find those mouse holes and bung them up. No, no, no. On second thoughts, I'll do that. You'll probably bung up the fireplace by mistake. <laughs> oh, dear. <coughs> oh. <coughs> marry me or not? Yes or no? Yes. Good, because the floor just fallen through in your bedroom. <laughs> Camp Town races, sing this song, do-da, do-da. 